Good morning. My name is Ralph Friedrichs. I am an author, an addiction recovery coach, a life coach, and, uh, and the host of this show, the Take Your Life Back Today radio show. You can see a video version of this if you go to YouTube on the channel Take Your Life Back Today show. Today is a time of grief for me. As many of you have heard, my father, George W. Friedrichs, has gone to be with the Lord yesterday, April 29th, 21. We will all miss him. He is now with Jesus. I wanted to share this email I received from Australia late last night. And I want to thank you, Evelyn, from Australia, for your email. She writes, Dear Ralph, I am so sorry to hear the devastating news. I never met your dad, but I know how wonderful and supportive he was to you over the years. And only uh, I can only start to imagine what you are feeling right now. You will gradually find comfort in all the happy memories that he leaves with you. Your father found his new life in Virginia, lived in the last uh, years of his life in contentment there, surrounded by family. And I know you made him happy. Your dad lived to see you find happiness, security, and he loved you very much. He will have died content for knowing that you are secure. And best of all, he did not suffer a long illness during his last moments. Make sure you find a time to grieve and allow yourself to do so and don't expect it to pass quickly. You see, losing a parent takes time to process for us mortals. Do you remember I was in the aftermath of losing my dad when we first became close years ago? I didn't fully recover from that for at least two years and made some very strange decisions and acted out of character for much of that time. Do you remember all that, Ralph, when you helped me with prayer? I wish I could be there with you to try to help you now. I'm giving you a big hug from here in Australia, and you know that's halfway across the globe, but I am right there with you. I'm sending you my love to you and to your family. Ralph, Take care and hang in there, and I know God will always bless you. Sincerely, Evelyn T. from Sydney, Australia. Thank you very much, Evelyn. Folks, call me at 844-405-HELP. Together, you and I, we can help each other take our lives back. Be good to yourselves. Always be good to each other. Remember, a smile to anyone can change their day in their life and make a difference in your life. George W. Friedrichs, 31937 to 429. 2021. May he rest in the arms of Jesus. Take good care and have a great day with your new life. With